What's up, ballers? This is kimchi and tofu. Yeah. yeah. All right, guys, we're going to Kuroko no uh, basketball episode number eight. We're getting through these uh, playoffs pretty quick too. Yeah. So we have to go against uh, the kings. <laughs> Okay, the kingdoms, the three kingdoms. I'm glad that uh, we're going straight up to the quarterfinal because I was like, I wanted to see like one at a time, but you know, like like they said, the one percent gets there, and that's just like the beginning of it, it, and then you have to get into the bigger tournament. So it's kind of like like the World Cup, but instead of it's Japanese basketball. All right, guys, thank you guys for joining us. Let's go and start Kurokono Basket episode eight. <gasps> Oh, oh, bread. I love oh, bread. Those, yeah, look at how many he's eating. <laughs> he only has a small sandwich. Right? <laughs> what is in these boxes? <laughs> so, yeah, she was carrying both of them by, by herself, too. Oh. 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 Ah, so the recordings of the last games last year. Damn, they got a DVD of Seho too. <laughs> yeah. This guy thinks he's too good. He doesn't need to watch yeah, it. Yeah, I don't need to watch it. As usual. <laughs> He's the one that came after, but even I didn't even see him. Me either. Seho versus uh, Kitawara? Wow, they play like super pressure. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I feel like little thugs ganging up on him. <laughs> <laughs> They're very, uh, they have a lot of stamina. To oh, play yeah. like that. Yeah. Oh, Kuroko knows this guy. Oh my god, he stopped Kisekun. Oh, Whoa. So he's really good. Oh, this is so cool. The miracles with uh, him right here. <laughs> Please pass the ball. あんたのせいで俺だけ今日焼き入れられるっすよ。素顔ともきだ。楽しいな。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ
Last place goes to Aquarius. Oh no. Uh oh. He's actually butthurt about it. Hmm? He's actually oh, yeah. butthurt. Oh wow, so he's gonna go against Kagami? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, man, if he can defense really well against Kise, Kagami should be no problem. Mm -hmm. Doesn't look like anyone has like the positiveness of like, we're gonna win. I think they were like, we lost. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'll give you. <laughs> no, that's not how it <laughs> Oh man, that's so funny. Pretend to be happy. <laughs> oh, nice one, nice. Oh my gosh, dude. Made him almost quit. They have another chance. Yeah. Redeem this is a different year. Well, it's because we have this guy. This guy. Oh, yeah. Kuroko's felt that way before. Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh. Damn, this is personal. So he's saying, let's play extra hard. Do it for the seniors, right? Yeah. <laughs> let's do this for the seniors. Remember, like you said, when you fight for others, not for yourself, stronger. Oh, they came to see the game. Oh my gosh, oh, no. we're 0 to 12. Wow, he oh, can't even defense. go around. Wow, around him. There we go. In, in, there we in. go. Come on. Oh. oh my god. Of course, you have to get through that wall. Man, what's Kuroko doing? I want to see Kuroko. Gosh, man. This guy's just playing with, with Taiga. Look at him, he's just having fun guarding him. Oh, they're not as good as I thought. Oh, oh fighting words, fighting words, come on, push. Oh, foul. Oh my god, he already has two fouls already. Oh, do they cover Kuroko that well, though? Oh, here it is. Everybody's Oh my blocked. god, everyone's take. Oh, no one's open. This and, is and what's Kuro going on. And Kuroko doesn't shoot either. No. We need a lot of screens in there, man. Yeah. We need to use some bodies. Oh, Martial arts, old martial arts. <laughs> Wait, what? Namba running. Oh! <laughs> Whoa! Oh, they, so they have some strategies to what they do. Yeah, how they keep their stamina. Man, and he's even stronger too. <laughs> Dude. Is that why they're all in black? Whoa, little ninjas. <laughs> oh. Oh, just give him a little crossover. Uh. But they'll be more vulnerable to fakes because they're just so on you. You know? True. Yeah, he's gonna pull off like a crossover or fake, man. <laughs> but he's only human too. <laughs> oh, wow. So this is gonna be freaking Kagami's huh? spotlight. Oh, man. Look at this. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, fake, fake! Yeah, oh, yeah, there yeah. you go! There, there you go! go. Crossover! <laughs> nice. Okay. Now, now the wall. Goliath. Yeah, he, he just really want to win this game. Yeah. Oh, nice! Our first point. Slam dunk. <laughs> that was one on one too, mm. without Kuroko. Moi kai, moi kai. Moi kai. <laughs> First time anyone passed him? <laughs> Dang. He's excited. <laughs> oh, so uh, he, it's about him getting his time to shine too. Yeah, so the thing in basketball, you know, they play man to man and they're like really on you. So, you know. It's so fresh. <laughs> 
Sorry. So frustrating because they're like, ooh, ooh, ooh. Dude, I can't do when, you, when you actually play, sometimes it's so bad because I've actually played against a team like that too. And they won't even let you, you can't even breathe. And let's say that you pass them a little bit, they'll find ways to like, they'll pull your shirt a little bit too mm. so that you kind of lose that. So it's like they're always on you and that's a really strong strategy. But the weakness is, is that they're more prone to fakes because the thing is, their um, instincts, it's wherever right the, the foot moves, is you move. Yeah. So if you fake it, that they means that they... Too. Oh, no. The, well, they, they get go faked. Yeah. They, they go that side. So, so that's where the crossover comes in. Uh, that's what which happened back in the Utah Jazz versus uh, Chicago Bulls. Michael Jordan's last shot of his career, it was down to the buzzer beater shot. Right, and um, Utah. It was uh, uh, Chicago Bulls ball uh -huh. with about uh, 15 seconds left or something, and that's when Jordan, you know, faked them because they're on the pressure. Like they have like we're only 15 seconds. We have to make sure that defense is strong, right? Oh. So they're always on. They're, he was on Jordan like the whole time, but Jordan that he was like this is the perfect chance. So he went in like he was gonna drive it in. And then he faked it, pushed back, and that guy went flying all the way that way. Oh. Jordan with the open shot, bam! That's how they won. But that's that's exactly what's going on here, or what happened with um, Taiga was, you know, that that means I have to be faster. So since wherever he when he goes right, he he's always there, right? So remember, he faked right, right. and then he crossed left right away, and he gunned him, and that's when he passed him right there. So. Um, so that's why when you're too, when you're guarding too close to him, mm -hmm. the the one problem with that is they can you can like they, you can get passed easily. So so that's the thing. Oh, that's good to know. I wish I knew that back in my basketball church days. Oh, uh, basketball church. I raged so much. I had to stop playing basketball because I kept getting fouls. I kept pushing my way oh through my like gosh. him. Oh my gosh! Yeah, you, yeah, you 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 will be so a fouler. <laughs> That was pretty cool because we didn't really see much of Kuroko's spotlight on this one. We actually saw Kuroko struggling. Like, dude, he got the ball and it's like, dude, nobody is open at all. I'm oh. just uh, surprised that there's no screen uh, playing here. But yeah, yeah, Taiga, man, went in for the dunk. Boom, first point. Cool. I'm actually surprised uh, to see that, you know, they made a team where their defense is just really strong. Mm -hmm. And they incorporated <laughs> martial arts. What the heck? Yeah. Have you ever tried running like that? No. It feels really weird because when you run, you go the opposite like this, right? Yeah. But then trying to go like this, it just feels weird. Now, the, the defender guy, the baldy, huh. you know how he smiled at the end? Yeah. That guy's gonna get serious now, so it's a challenge. This is a challenge. So I think the next episode we're gonna be seeing him and Kagami just one on one the whole time or something, cause he's gonna want him and Kagami wants him. Yeah. So it's just gonna be like one on one the whole time or something. <laughs> Not much of Kuroko this time. Maybe for Kuroko for the buzzer beater. I think the Probably. next match is gonna be buzzer beater win. Buzzer beater. Yeah. By the way, this is going because we're down a lot of points, but yeah. we'll see. Yeah. But all right, guys, that was Kuroko Basketball Episode 8. Thank you guys for joining us. We'll see you next time. Yes, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.